If you are a gamer, you know about the importance of having a good gaming monitor in your setup. You need a high refresh rate for smooth animations, a low response time to remove ghosting, and a good panel type for better picture quality. Today I will be teaching you about the advancement of monitor technology, its function, and the feature that it holds. For starters, a monitor is an output device that displays video images and text. Most monitors are made up of circuitry, a screen, power supply, menu navigation system, and casing. The very first monitor was invented by a German scientist named Carl Ferdinand Braun in 1897. He created the cathode ray tube as the first computer monitor in Germany. The cathode ray tube, also known as CRT, works by emitting light when electrons strike the phosphors that are coated at the end of the CRTs. Its main function was to display colorless graphics. After the advancement to color cathode ray tubes, we got to see both text and graphics being displayed to monitors. These monitors look like industrial cabinets with a flat or curved screen. Its features included an anti-reflective coating, video input signal, non-interlaced screen, and an industrial metal cabinet. The advantages of CRT monitors include their inexpensive price, fast response time, adaptability with any aspect ratio and resolution, ability to withstand damage, repairability, and high pixel resolution. However, it also has many disadvantages, including its large size, low brightness, large power consumption, production of large amounts of heat, harmful magnetic fields, and low refresh rate. Currently, LCD and LED monitors are the most common display devices used by people worldwide. LCD monitors stand for Liquid Crystal Display and they use the Active Matrix Liquid Crystal Display technology which is a high resolution flat panel display. These monitors use technology that designs the monitor's backlight to output a color image to generate light at the back of the LCD monitor. The backlight controls the opacity of each pixel or the red, blue, and green lighting elements through electronic signals. So when the screen wants to show a black image, it will attempt to block the light, while if it wants to show a white image, it will let more light through. For this reason, LCD screens are not able to display as complex and deep blacks. The advantages of LCD monitors include their small size, clear and bright images, adaptability with different sizes, energy efficiency, and durability. The disadvantages include its fixed resolution and aspect ratio, lower contrast, price, fixed viewing angle, and slow response time. In contrast, LED monitors have three main configurations, direct lit, edge lit, and full array. Edge lit is the most common form of an LED screen. It places LEDs only at the edge of the screen, allowing the screens themselves to be much thinner. As there are fewer LEDs than in a full array, you might have problems with dynamic lighting if your screen hasn't been properly configured. The advantages of LED monitors include their high quality images, energy efficiency, longer lifespan, and programmability. The disadvantages include its unstable colors, price, inconsistent contrast ratios, and its production of light pollution. However, LED monitors are cheaper than LCD monitors because LEDs are cheaper to produce than CCFL, which is a cold cathode fluorescent lamp tubes that are used in LCD displays. With the current pace at which display technology is advancing, you should expect to see revolutionary products being introduced to the monitor market. One of which is the OLED display, which stands for Organic Light Emitting Diode. This display can organically emit light when it makes contact with an electric current. It uses a diode to direct the light or electric current in a singular forward direction depending on its placement. Its main advantage is its ability to function in all lighting conditions and its energy efficiency because it uses no backlight. This display is predicted to replace LED and LCD monitors in the near future. Now before I take off, I'll leave you with a few great monitor recommendations. If you are looking for a budget monitor, I would recommend getting the ASUS 23-inch LED monitor priced at $164. If you are looking for a gaming monitor, I would recommend getting the Dell Alienware 27-inch 240Hz 1ms G-Sync monitor which is priced at $880. 
If you are looking for a productivity monitor, I would recommend getting the BenQ 24-inch iCare IPS monitor priced at $210. The links to all of these monitors will be placed in the description below. Thank you for watching everyone and I hope you learned something new about monitors.